Greetings and salutations YouTube here once again by my face it is another edition of the Russell Cage Experience from Cumberland Kentucky no no sorry Williamsburg Kentucky Cumberland yeah anyway uh, <laughs> Raw Review September 1st 2009 uh, when I turned it on uh, JBL was in the ring talking to CM Punk basically saying that he's going to take home the title um, at Unforgiven uh, Ken comes out, basically says Rey Mysterio, even though Mike Adamley uh, made the match, Rey Mysterio would not be there tonight um, in this battle royal uh, because Rey Mysterio is in Hades. Different choice of terms, but yes, you get the point. Uh, then Batista comes out and just basically cleans house. Um, and that's how we opened up the show, so uh, can tell this, this was probably going to be a, a pretty decent match by the looks of it. Um, we'll get in that in a minute. Uh, next up we have Charlie Haas Cena Ch I don't know. Charlie Haas basically. Uh, against Kofi Kingston. Uh, Kofi picks up the win here against uh, Charlie here with the um, Trouble in Paradise. Um, nothing really to talk much about here. I um, hope it's sad that they, they had Kofi with the Intercontinental title, and now he's fighting people like Charlie Haas. Put him in a legitimate feud, people, alright? Seriously. Because um, Charlie Haas, I don't see him sticking around WWE much longer with the way that um, the way that things have been going for him, basically. So, I'll we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, next we have a... King Priceless, Cody Rhodes, Ted DiBiase, uh, backstage with Randy Orton, who apparently made an appearance talking down about the champions of Raw and, and that sort of thing. Um, hopefully we'll see Randy Orton back soon. Um, I think WWE is, in, WWE is in need of Randy Orton to be back um, with the injuries that they've got going on here left and right. Um, you know, so... Uh, Randy Orton basically just smacks Cody Rhodes in the face and kind of gives him a little extra initiative that, you know what, you, you need to guys need to get your tag tiles back and, and grow a set, basically. That's what he's saying. Uh, we, we go to the backstage segment with uh, Tiffany and Teddy Long, backstage with Mike Adamley, uh, talking about the, uh, the ECW Battle Royal that they're actually going to have next. Um, and Kane interrupts and basically just tells Adamley that Ray Mysterio is not going to be there tonight. Um, that he took care of him, and that's that. Um, so we, we go to the ECW Battle Royal. All right match here. Um, honestly, I think I enjoyed the, uh, the women's 60 the tag match better, but, you know, hey. Um, Mark Henry picks up the victory here. Kind of shocked me that they didn't have one of the other people pick up the victory, you know. Uh, so, but, uh, especially either, either, you know, Matt Hardy or Finley, uh, would be the two that I could, could see winning that, but, uh, Mark Henry picks up the victory as him and Matt, uh, Matt Hardy, Mark Henry and Matt Hardy at the end, so, uh, like I said before, decent match, um, I wouldn't, honestly, I wouldn't mind seeing, uh, the men's hold the ECW title. For a little while, so we'll we'll have to see what happens with the championship scramble. Um, next in our filler match, Jamie Noble uh, versus William Regal. Jamie picking up the victory here uh, for once between him and uh, Regal. Uh, so we're probably going to see this, you know, probably going to see this feud a little while. Uh, this might might have caught Layla's attention now. We'll just have to wait and see how this plays out. Um, next up. Uh, I, w I don't know if I give this match of the night, but it, uh, this and the ECW Battle Royal were my two favorites of the night. Um, we have Jillian, Katie Lee, and Beth Phoenix against Mickey, uh, Mickey James, Kelly Kelly, and the returning Candace Michelle. And there was a one spot where it looked like she kind of messed it up, but, you know, um, just she just needs to work a little bit harder. I was kind of hoping to see Gail Kim, uh, you know, in, in the women's division on Raw. Hopefully we'll see her soon and she can uh, can be with Beth Phoenix and, you know, just kind of add add to this women's division. 
Um, next match we have is Santino versus D'Lo Brown. Um, well, I once again call another filler match. Uh, you know, Honk uh, Honk Man Santino is going to try to break Honky Tonk Man's record uh, and be the greatest Intercontinental Champion of all times. Side note: I used to act like Honky Tonk Man when I was little, so this kind of annoyed me. Santino trying to be like the Honky Tonk Man. You cannot be like the Honky Tonk Man. He's the greatest Intercontinental Champion ever. Keep that in mind, Santino. Um, next, it looked like we was going to have Miz and Morrison versus Crime Time. Uh, Cody and Ted jumped Crime Time, so really there was no contest. Uh, they got their tag titles back. So I'm kind of looking forward to maybe even getting to see the uh, Team Prices versus Crime Time tag match, maybe on YouTube. Uh, Dad, I'll get to watch the paper. Uh, after we uh, come back from commercial, we see Cody and Ted walking down the hallway. They run into Orton again, just kind of have a stare down, just kind of saying one of those things like, dude, look at that. Choke on that, Orton. Um, we have an interview with Batista coming up next. Just basically says he's going to win by any means possible. He's going to go out there and beat people senseless. Um, so he has a working game plan there, uh, but didn't work for him because he was the first one eliminated. Uh, so, which is why we have next up the Raw Battle Royal: um, Batista versus JBL versus CM Punk versus Kane. No Rey Mysterio until after CM Punk is eliminated. Uh, so Ray comes out afterwards, and I don't know if he won the Battle Royal or if Kane still won, and Ray just jumped in. Don't know. So, uh, in the end of the night, we have the contract signing with HBK and YTJ. Uh, just basically them saying the same thing they did last week. I don't want to be responsible, you know, WWE to be responsible for what we what happens. Our families aren't going to watch this, that, and the other. Um, so we're really just kind of pushing the storylines along this week. Uh, like I said, I don't know if I give them matches of the night, but uh, the women's, the, the six women tag match and the ECW Battle Royal were my two favorites. Um, even though more Henry won the ECW Battle Royal. But uh, overall wasn't that entertaining of a raw to me, but uh, it was good seeing Orton on uh, on camera. It's good that they're trying to keep him uh, keep him fresh on TV, you know, just kind of keep his posts on him and all that. So, uh, Orton, hope you get better soon, dude, and you need to hurry up and get back. But uh, maybe, you know, get you back in the title picture. Uh, so, but overall... All right, we're all nothing too big, nothing spectacular, but uh, I mean, I really don't know what to say about it. I mean, it's pretty much self-explanatory tonight. So uh, that's my thoughts on Raw. Um, we might see uh, we may, we may see the ECW title change hands. We may see the Raw title change hands at the pay-per-view. I don't know yet, um, and. I'm kind of hoping that the title doesn't change hands on SmackDown uh, when that happens, so we'll, we'll just have to wait and play it out and see. Um, going to try to watch ECW tomorrow night, no promises. Uh, also, going to try to watch TNA Thursday because uh, I'm getting interested in TNA a little bit more than WWE now, so TNA, keep up the good work. So, y'all have a great night or day or whatever, depending on when you watch this. And uh, thank you for watching, and um, I'm looking to maybe do a question-answer video here soon. Uh, I know DJ Sleazy C, he just did one. Um, so if you have any questions for me, I'll, I'll tell you the same thing that he told his subscribers. Uh, shoot me the questions, uh, let me know, uh, and I'll try to get those answered in a, in a video, a special video. And uh, if you get a chance, check out DJ Sleazy C. I, I, I enjoy his uh, reviews and his thoughts. And uh, so I'll, I'll post the side link in the, or link in the sidebar over here for you all if you want to check it out. So uh, you guys take it easy. And uh, thank you for watching. Good night.